Hello everyone, this is Sonali Bhomi from Indian Institute of Technology, Rubiki. This presentation is about investigation on friction processes of concrete. A new methodology has been developed using DIC to estimate the deep of effective crack of concrete beams under fatigue and static loading. A series of geometrically similar beam of small, medium, large charges under fatigue and static loading has been tested in this study. Further, the critical energy dissipation for small, medium, large beams under fatigue loading has calculated. The deep of effective crack has been located corresponding to the negligible horizontal displacement jam on either side of crack. During DIC analysis, origin is marked at deep of initial crack notch. Horizontal displacement fields are obtained corresponding to various reference lines through DIC analysis. The typical variation of horizontal displacement values against distance x corresponding to the reference lines has been shown in figure 4. In this case, the displacement jump has been calculated corresponding to the peak load with respect to different horizontal cross sections. Similar procedures has been adopted in order to locate the tip of effective crack for beams under fatigue loading. An increase in propagation of crack for observed in figure 5 from peak load to 15% post peak load. Corresponding to figure 5a, the effective crack length is expected to be critical and it has been confirmed with DIC analysis. Similar observation has been made in figure 6f in the case of fatigue loading where the possibility of critical effective crack at 1118 cycle has been confirmed with the calculated value prior to failure. Experimental results of medium beam specimen for both static and fatigue loading cases has been considered in this valuation study. A reasonably good agreement can be observed between DIC analysis result and experimentally accurate values. Thanks for your attention.